Imagine opening the news in 2026 and seeing this. Tesla Model 2 Senior Edition adopts SpaceX technology in its chassis. Wow, it's no exaggeration to say that a lot of people were stunned. After all, who expected a car designed for drivers over 65 to inherit rocket-like structures? That's exactly it. Tesla wasn't messing around. They took materials that used to withstand absurd temperatures in space and put them into the skeleton of a compact electric car. And it's not just aesthetics or marketing. We're talking about improvements that make a real difference in everyday life, especially for those who value comfort, lightness, and safety on the road. And the secret lies precisely in those aerospace alloys that SpaceX helped develop. They are lighter than regular steel, but much stronger. The result? A car up to 55 kilograms lighter. Seems like a small amount, right? But in the world of EVs, that's a huge gain. Less weight means less engine effort, more efficient fuel consumption, and smoother driving, especially if the driver no longer has the same vigor to turn the steering wheel with gusto. And you know what's even crazier? Even lighter, the structure became more rigid, it's like becoming thinner and stronger at the same time. The shift in the center of gravity is also something that goes unnoticed by many people, but it has a huge impact. Tesla repositioned some modules and lightened the top of the car with thin alloy panels. The car is now closer to the ground, more glued to the road. And, honestly, anyone over 60 knows how bad it is to feel the car sway in strong winds or change lanes with that feeling of instability. With this adjustment, driving on the highway has become a much more stable, almost therapeutic experience. But it doesn't stop there. Side impact protection has been completely redesigned. The crumple zones have been intelligently redesigned. This is because, statistically, people over 65 are at greater risk of angled collisions. Tesla's response was direct deflect the force of the impact before it reaches the cabin. Internal simulations already indicate greater resistance than the Model 3, which, incidentally, was already a benchmark in this area. And more people are commenting that this new system could even rival SUVs like the Volvo EX30. Another brilliant idea was the application of heat dissipating materials around the battery. Inspired by the system used in SpaceX rockets, these composites help maintain the ideal temperature even during fast charging or in extreme conditions, like the heat of a desert in Arizona or the freezing cold of Minnesota. This reduces the risk of range loss in winter, which is a constant nightmare for EV owners living in cold climates. It is estimated that the range in cold weather increases by between 11 and 18 kilometers just because of this special thermal layer. The steering also becomes more predictable with a lighter car. And for those who no longer have the reflexes of a 20-year-old, that's invaluable. Tesla knows this. Less weight also means less jolting when accelerating, braking, or maneuvering on slippery surfaces. Ever seen an elderly person trying to control a heavy car on a wet ramp? Exactly. With this chassis adjustment, the Model 2 Senior Edition makes this type of situation much less stressful. Another interesting point is that this type of innovation completely breaks the logic of the industry. While brands like BYD and Nissan make small improvements with each version, gaining 20 or 30 kilos of weight at most, Tesla comes in with double that. It's not just because they can, but because they decided to invest in something that other brands still treat as a luxury. Engineering designed specifically for the driver, and not just to fit the company's budget. If the chassis already looked like something out of science fiction, wait until you see how Tesla redesigned the Model 2 Senior Edition's entry system. You know that uncomfortable moment of bending down, tucking your legs in, twisting your body, and praying you don't hit your head when getting into the car? Well, forget all that. In 2026, Tesla decided that older drivers wouldn't have to go through this mini Olympic challenge every time they went to the store. And the solution they created mixes automotive engineering with tricks borrowed directly from SpaceX. Literally. It all starts with the new wide arch hinges. 
Tesla took inspiration from the lightweight, durable covers used by SpaceX on rocket maintenance panels and applied that idea to the car doors. The result? They open at a wider angle than usual, something around 8 to 12 degrees extra. It may seem like a small difference, but in practice, it's what allows you to enter the car facing forward, with your body straighter, without having to twist your hips or throw yourself inside as if it were gymnastics. It's the kind of detail that anyone with knee pain appreciates with tears in their eyes. And here comes one of the smartest touches in this project, the lowering of the door sill. Tesla reduced the height of the sill, that part you have to put your leg over to get in, by two to three centimeters. This alone reduces the strain on the joints, especially if the driver is dealing with limitations in their hips or lower back. Compared to other electric compacts like the Hyundai Kona or the Nissan Leaf, the Model 2 Senior Edition already wins in this detail alone. But the best part is the new seat track with entry assistance. You know those luxury cars, like premium SUVs, where the seat moves to make getting in easier? Well, Tesla brought that to a compact car. The seat literally moves outwards and rises a little, as if inviting the driver to sit down. After the person sits, it smoothly returns to its correct position. This avoids that uncomfortable compression in the back and makes getting in and out of the car more natural and fluid. It's almost like sitting in a smart armchair. This type of assistance is extremely rare in cars of this size. It usually only appears in expensive and enormous models. And again, this shows that Tesla understood one simple thing. Aging shouldn't mean giving up technology. On the contrary, it should be precisely when you need it most. Mobility is one of the first things to be lost with age. And any system that restores autonomy to the driver is a silent revolution. To complete this package, Tesla also redesigned the seats with this audience in mind. They remain modern and stylish, but now feature padding with adjusted density to better absorb the impact of ascents and descents. Even the response time of the seat's motor has been recalibrated to avoid that abrupt movement that can be startling or uncomfortable. Everything is smoother gentler on the body, a feature that doesn't always receive the attention it deserves in the automotive market. And check out this detail. The seat's own sensors recognize if the person is having difficulty moving. The system then automatically adjusts the timing and angle of the seat's entry adjustment. It might seem like a luxury, but it's the kind of thing that makes a huge difference for someone with arthritis or muscle stiffness. The feeling of being in control without depending on external help, is worth every second of this technology. The first thing you notice when entering the Model 2 Senior Edition is that the interior no longer has that cold, futuristic spaceship feel that some Teslas had. Now, the space feels welcoming, almost as if it were designed by someone who truly understands how the body changes over time. And this starts with the A-pillars, those between the windshield and the side windows. They have been thinned, not only to make the design lighter, but mainly to improve lateral visibility, something essential for those who no longer have the same agility to turn their neck quickly during a turn or maneuver. This refinement in the pillars eliminates some of the blind spots that bother older drivers so much. Many people don't realize it, but a small obstruction in the field of vision can be the difference between safety and fright and this connects perfectly with the new seat positioning. Tesla has slightly raised the driver's field of vision, about one, five semimetrum. But this, combined with the reconfiguration of the dashboard, gives the feeling of a taller car, easier to control, without actually feeling like an SUV. The driver feels above the road, but still with that classic control of a smaller car. Another subtle but ingenious detail is in the steering wheel. Tesla is implementing a new driver assistance algorithm that adjusts resistance based on micro movements of the wrist. This means that at low speeds, such as when parking or maneuvering in a tight space, the steering wheel turns with much less effort. Great for those with arthritis or who simply don't have as much strength in their hands anymore. And the best part? 
This doesn't sacrifice control at high speeds because the system adapts in real time. You could say it's almost as if the car reads your intentions and this feeling that the car understands you spreads throughout the interior. The dashboard controls, for example, now have physical buttons for vital functions such as climate control and emergency lights. This goes against the digital minimalism that Tesla has always championed, but this time it makes sense. Instead of navigating submenus on a 15-inch screen, the driver can simply reach out and feel where the button is. It's like having an intuitive car again, only with the brain of a supercomputer hidden behind it. The ventilation system also underwent significant changes. The air vents were positioned to avoid direct drafts on the face, something that bothers many more sensitive people, and were calibrated to maintain a constant temperature without peaks of heat or cold. It may seem like an exaggeration, but this prevents dry skin, dry eyes, and even respiratory discomfort, especially in those with pre-existing conditions. In short, the cabin was designed to be comfortable for hours on end, and not just beautiful in promotional photos. Another improvement is the navigation interface of the control unit. The icons have been enlarged, the contrasts improved, and the touch response is more precise, with light tactile feedback, like a gentle tap on the finger, which helps those who no longer have the same dexterity or steadiness. And look at this interesting detail. Even the font of the texts has been redesigned. It's more legible, with less thin letters and better spacing between items. It seems like a small detail, but anyone who has ever had to put their face close to the screen to read the GPS will understand its value. The sound system has also been adjusted. Instead of emphasizing bass and treble as in many sports models, here the focus was on vocal clarity. This makes voice commands and hands-free calls more understandable. Not to mention that the acoustic insulation has been improved. Less external noise, less mental fatigue, more driving pleasure. This is something that honestly, every brand should do. Not just for the elderly, but for anyone who wants a little peace and quiet inside the car. Tesla knew that simply creating a comfortable car wasn't enough. It needed to go further and think about how to make driving safer and less mentally exhausting, especially for those whose reflexes aren't as sharp as they used to be. That's where the new sensor suite in the Model 2 Senior Edition comes in. To Senior Edition, now, in addition to the traditional cameras Tesla has always used, the car is equipped with a medium-range radar specially calibrated to detect objects up to 50 meters away. Even in low visibility situations like fog, heavy rain, or at night, it's as if the car has gained a new vision, deeper, more predictable. This change in the sensor suite isn't just about impressing with technical specifications. It addresses a real need. Many older drivers struggle with depth perception or take longer to react to sudden changes in traffic. With a radar that anticipates situations even before the human eye perceives them, the Model 2 can smooth out responses, issuing less abrupt alerts and avoiding those sudden corrections that are more frightening than helpful. This gives the driver precious reaction time. And, let's face it, that's worth its weight in gold. The processing unit has also been updated. Now, the system responds up to 25 milliseconds faster than the previous version of the Model 2. Does that seem like a small difference? But it's not. In practice, this means that the information captured by the sensors is processed almost instantly, making the alerts smoother and more natural. It's as if the car whispers a warning instead of shouting an alert. This is very helpful for those who are easily startled or have difficulty dealing with sudden stimuli while driving. But perhaps the star of this new generation is the predictive lane assist system. Instead of reacting only to lane markings, as traditional systems do, the Model 2 analyzes up to 450 meters ahead, taking into account road curvature, traffic flow, and the behavior of other drivers. With this, it can correct the trajectory in an anticipatory and fluid way without those nudges on the steering wheel that can confuse the driver. 
It's a type of assistance that seems magical. It's so natural. And there's more. The side camera system now covers a field of view up to six degrees wider. This may sound too technical, but in practice, it means seeing cyclists coming from behind or cars approaching at diagonal intersections better. Those that often surprise those who are used to only looking in their rear view mirrors. This new angle makes a difference, especially when exiting a tight parking space or at intersections with poor visibility. The rear also received a boost with a short range radar optimized for speeds below 25 pilintil meters h. Ideal for precise parking, of course, but also for detecting small objects like shopping carts or even distracted pedestrians behind the vehicle. The idea is simple, to protect the driver from surprises and potential accidents without taking away their ability to maneuver. After all this intelligence applied to driving, the next step was to rethink something that, incredibly, still makes many people nervous, parking. And when the driver is already in the 65 plus age range, this everyday challenge can turn into a real nightmare. But Tesla saw this as an opportunity and spared no effort to make the process smoother and less stressful. The new self-parking system in the Model 2 Senior Edition is not only faster at identifying parking spaces, but also gentler in maneuvers. And believe me, this makes an enormous difference. The software was calibrated to detect spaces as narrow as 2.4 meters, which is narrow even by compact car standards. Furthermore, it cross-references information on approach angle, lateral distance, and proximity to obstacles with much greater precision. The driver doesn't even need to ask twice. The car practically knows when you're looking for a place to park and acts automatically. This avoids that classic situation where you try three or four times while other drivers honk to get the car in perfectly. And for those who still prefer to park manually, visibility has been greatly improved. The cameras have higher definition and the proximity sensors can now clearly distinguish a shopping cart from a metal post. This is more useful than it seems, especially when you're in a sloping parking space or with low obstacles that are difficult to see in the rearview mirror. And all this without exaggerated alarms or rushed messages, the system was designed to guide, not to panic. Navigation also received a smart upgrade with Safe Route Assist. This system is like an experienced local guide inside the car. It assesses not only traffic, but also the complexity of intersections, the accident history of certain roads, and even the level of aggressiveness of drivers in certain neighborhoods. Thus, the car chooses calmer routes, with less hard braking and fewer lane changes. This reduces mental fatigue and helps maintain concentration during the journey, something essential for those who drive more cautiously. Another interesting point is the contextual alerts which adapt to the environment. Instead of emitting a loud sound every time someone passes near the car, the system assesses the real risk of that movement. If it's just a pedestrian strolling, it softens the alert. If it's a bicycle at speed, it alerts more firmly. This avoids sensory overload, the famous excess of information that, in the end, hinders more than it helps. And to top it all off, the intelligent route assistant analyzes the driver's habits. For example, if it notices that the person avoids complex intersections or prefers wider roads, it will prioritize that type of route in the future. It's as if the car is learning along with the owner, respecting the pace of the person behind the wheel. And there's nothing more reassuring than feeling that the car understands your preferences and limitations.